Hello lovely people and welcome to my channel. Today we are going to set up a Smith box and import some um, CSV files, uh, mod files in the regulation bin. So first step we have to do, need two things, Elden Ring copy of Elden Ring, no matter which copy you're using, it doesn't matter. You're using crack version, pad version, you're using Steam one, it doesn't matter, it's same. All of them have same method, okay? First you need an Elden Ring and we need a Smith box. So what you need to do, first you need to go to the website or you just uh, Google it, just tap uh, Smith box and go there and click on the right side here to see. You cannot see here, you cannot see down there, you need to click this one. When you click this one, go down and this is the main file. You need to click here and download it because I already downloaded I've been doing this one for long so yeah so I'm not going to download now so you have to download it unzip it and follow the next step okay now we have Smith box and we have Elden ring what we need to do we need to to make a folder before we need to start everything folder we need to make two folder obviously okay first um, for mod which we're going to download the mod we need to use okay and for second we need a folder for regulation bin just give a name test okay and it must be a empty folder okay empty folder no need to do because we have we need to create uh, another regulation bin okay so let's download the mod first okay you know how to download mod just Go to the nexus mods.com you can here you can type here games and elden ring are up to you but you also if you have account if you already have account then you already added some games here like i already added some games i've been like mods for for long so that's why i don't need it so yeah so you need to make account first then you need to um, add your games and you can start modding okay first what do you do you need to download a mod any mod who has a csv file so easiest way i'm just going to show you because uh, i think this is the easiest mod i know there's also many mods but this one is easy so its mod name is unlock all grace so we go here this one Then we go to files. Need to download manually. So we need to download manual because we don't have um, premium then. So it's slow down. Download it doesn't matter. So what do you do? Go to there and put the mod there. That's it. The first step is done. We need to open Elden ER or we have to extract this one in Winner. There you go. First extracted. Now when you look inside we do have csv okay we have csv file it's called phone fire work param so we need this one you can copy it or cut it i'm going to cut it because i want to put here right here in the front so we need this one we don't need regulation bin okay and then next we head to the smith box on um, you can open the smith box through um a rare, run as an administrator or just just click it okay just click it okay when you do the first time it will show you like this but not this one because i've been doing this one first before so yeah so when you open this one it will always show like this okay because yeah so you need to create new project like create project give the name any i'm going to give the name as a test doesn't matter so project directory where we have to save our project which directory i mean which folder so i already created test folder on the uh, desktop so i'm going to use this one then we need an executable game file which is i believe you need to go to where is the game installed you can go here i already installed my games here in the d folder or you can just uh, you will also do this one because I'm using crack one, so you need just executable file this one. You don't need a regulation bin, okay? 
because I'm using executable file so if you don't know where is your folder so you can just click here and open file locations so there is it file location okay this is your um, executable exe file okay you need this one for that and then next you need to head to this one you need to click here import uh, raw names because uh, what I, we have in the regulation bin then if there's any name any add-in mod anything they will show you here okay so hit create hold on for a while yeah task completed so we need to head to the next part we need to add to the param editor okay param editor this there's nothing okay you make sure there's nothing because when you start first time there's nothing no mod added because it's clean Elden Ring files all of them okay so when you make you have to make sure that there's no anything added so you can just write down modified okay so you see there's nothing modifier so yeah what we need to do now you need to search we already unzip our mod csv file we took it so we need to use that one the first thing we need to do we need to write down bond b on bo and bond okay then the first one this one and see there's nothing add everything is clean so how to import file you need to go to data go to import csv do not export export is another thing you need to take from the mod and make it another csv that export okay import import file then go down from files i believe and all fields okay all fields then we can go get to them this pc not this pc sorry we go to desktop so here elden Ring mod we need this csv file okay csv file okay this one then you can click hit, hit click voila done okay you see it's turned green and if you write down here modified it will show you all the modified what you have this is these are the location of all we have graces okay all graces location is these these are all these are okay all value all unlocked okay and when you hit here modified because we did just only one mod I added mod in the regulation bin so it, this is only showing one okay this is all there's nothing more nothing less okay what do you need to do hit the save all modified params just click it okay show is here save params you need to click you make sure again click again one more time then click it twice okay now when you here go here in the test folder you will see we already have a, created a new regulation bin we will use this regulation bin in the game okay so let's go to get to the game head to the game First, we need to go open file location okay um, before you need to replace the file any file I mean uh, regulation bin file you need to do this one original one you need to copy and save somewhere you think is safe okay it doesn't matter where just copy it okay and I'm, I'm going to copy and paste on just just as a demonstration okay paste here on the desktop okay you can copy this one and Put anywhere it will it save and you can just place it later and you can play as a normal Elden Ring without mod it. Okay. Now, second thing we have to do this one. You need to take this one and replace it. Okay. Replace the file. See that? It's replaced. Oh, sorry. Before I need to replace the file, I need to show you something because I make sure that there's no bone fires are. There's no bonfires are like you know not unlock. Uh, just did not show you. Oh my bad, sorry. We have resolution bin here. We need this resolution bin again back to the here. Okay. We need to replace this resolution bin with the resolution. Now I replace the regulation bin back because this one is original one. Before I need to start this one, I have to make sure that you already have nothing there because I want to show you something. Okay. So we can turn, we can open the game. 
first okay I'm just gonna show you guys there's nothing there and then I will add the regulation pin which we already modded okay so that what this this one is the original regulation pin so let's go head to the game first We go load it uh load it all. I'm going to the first one. It's level six. It's just a new profile. So yeah. Okay, I'm here in the lake of Veronia. Let's see this one. You see that? There's nothing unlocked. Just a few. This one, even the Church of Allies is not even unlocked. This one, this one, and I'm here. Okay. So let's go. See you again, Mortar. There's no Grace is unlocked. Turn off this game. And now we can replace with this one. Okay. Let's copy. Control C, Control V, place it. And yes, then I can close this one. We don't need this one now for that moment. Now let's go. Give one shot again. Okay. Now I'll show you how it's work. Because my uh, my crack version is latest latest version, um, which is came out in July third. So yeah, if you have old version and if you have the problem, you should download a uh, latest version. So it's doing well. Okay, we go here. I mean, it's working well. There's no error come out. Hit continue. Because I already have the profile already opened it before. Now I'm still on this one. Like. Moroni of the lakes, so yep. Now, and if I show you, see that all of the graces unlock, all the graces unlock. See here, see that, see that, see that, all the graces unlock. Um, if I you want me to travel any up there, I can travel, travel because I make sure that, um. It's it's okay. I can travel. See that? Fast travel. And even you can rest on the the grace, okay? Look here. All the graces unlock, okay? Even these graces also unlock in the Necron City too. Because I've already been there, okay? Here. See this one? This one? This one? This one is for the Ma Mog. Mog one. This is the Mog. Mog the Blood. Lord of Blood, yep, you can also travel through there, but do not travel, um, this mod is for, you need to travel before the boss, like, you cannot travel directly to the boss bonfire, if you track there, the, the game will crash, there will be bugs, and there will be like, you know, so yeah, do not travel to the bonfire, which is, is belongs to the boss, you need to be one before that bonfire, you need to call, because you need to fight, and you have to unlock by yourself, okay? So yeah, I, this is all how to import files. So yes, we did it. And thank you so much for watching. Okay, and enjoy your time.